Well, each day this week, just so we could play this music, we're giving you a glimpse inside the unusual part of our Strange Structures series. Today, up to Lafayette for a trip to the barn house. Here's our own farm hand, WB2 Morning reporter Chris Barrente. Hey, Chris. Natalie, don't you? Great song. Tom always takes Zsa Zsa Gabor's part, <laughs> right? Always. It's a little green acres here this morning up in Lafayette. And I'll tell you what, this is amazing. No need for New York. A little city, little country all in one here. Take a look. This is what I like to call the barn house. It's actually Lions Gate Event Center. And this barn, at one time a functioning barn complete with livestock and hay, is now one of the most amazing strange structures you will ever see. The silo behind me, five stories. It's got a glass floor on each store. We're gonna take you inside and show you the silo. Awesome, from a wine cellar to offices to guest bathrooms. All kinds of amazing rooms in here. This place is truly, truly a strange structure. And I'm gonna go inside in the next hour, so stick around for that. Time once again for our strange structure segment. If you think barns are a place for livestock and hay, well, you're out to pasture. Yeah, WB2 Morning reporter Chris Barrente giving us the tour of a farmhouse with a twist. Chris? Good morning, Natalie. How are you? Wow, cool. Peekaboo! <laughs> yeah, this, this is a silo like none you've ever seen. We are here at Lions Gate Center up in Lafayette. This is an old corn silo converted now, five stories. It's got a wine cellar way down there where my photographer is. It's got two bathrooms up as we go higher and higher along the silo. And then at the very, very top up here, there is a personal office with an amazing 360 degree view all the way around. Gorgeous, gorgeous view of the Rockies. Just one feature of Lionsgate Center that makes this whole place truly, truly a strange structure. We're going to give you the inside scoop, the inside tour. Uh, all morning long out here, I'm telling you, this place is super, super cool. My only problem is, you can see, of course, all the way down five stories, including the bathroom. And I have issues, so I have privacy issues. I don't know if I could use the bathroom in here or not, because, of course, you can see all the way down. But otherwise, have you guys ever seen anything quite like this? No, no that is beyond cool. That is, that is something else. We'll show you more in the next hour. It's just a spectacular place up here in Lafayette. So check it out, lionsgatecenter.com. All right, Chris, we'll see you next hour. Good morning, Colorado. I'm Chris Parente. Old McDonald may have had a farm, but he never had a farmhouse like this. Strange structures coming up. You'll want to see this one. Well, yee-haw, Natalie. You know, I, I learned fast working with Tom. You play with fire, you're gonna get burned, huh? But who knows? Look at this, fire and water together. This cool. It's one of the elements in a truly strange structure we call a lion feet up here in Lafayette. This is uh, a barn house, almost a hundred years old, converted into an amazing home. And the silo, well, you saw that earlier, we'll show it to you again, is just off the hook fantastic. Who, you say, who designed this amazing, strange structure? Well, look, it's the beautiful Marie Jenkinson. Good morning, Marie. Good morning. We got some video earlier that my photographer, Rick, shot. We'll show that right now uh, of this barn house up here in Lafayette. What was your inspiration? Because this is like nothing I've ever seen. Well, as soon as we bought the property and we saw the barn, we were amazingly in love with it, and we knew we were going to do something with it. Um, and over time, we just sort of developed in our heads. Over the years, we've had this property for 15 years. And uh, we just moved in six months ago. And you did all this design element yourself, including that silo with the glass floor all five stories up, right? Yep, sure did. A lot of inspiration from a number of places. How long did it take to go from a, a barn constructed in 1910 to a truly <laughs> strange structure? How long was the process? <laughs> uh, it was a, many years in the, my head and then a year on paper with the architect and engineers trying to make sure that you know it was all going to stay standing because it's a very old structure and uh, and then it was two years in construction so long and relatively painful but worth it in the end <laughs> <laughs> it sure is because it's just it's just an amazing amazing place thank you let's talk about Lionsgate uh, center because this is a part of really um 
a, a facility for banquets, weddings, receptions, etc. Right. We have two buildings. We have the Dove House, which is an old historic uh, building from 1927 that we renovated and restored. And then the larger gatehouse building is um, another one that we purchased and added on quite a bit. We do a lot of weddings, about 400 a year. 400 a year. Yeah. <laughs> Sadly, none of those are mine. <laughs> Not even close to getting married, but this place is absolutely fantastic. We're out here on top of one of the layers of the barn. It's just out of the store. And just show that silo one more time. We're going to go back inside uh, later and show you the inside of that silo. So you got to see it to believe it. LionsgateCenter.com. Thank you, Chris. Chris joining us again now from the barn house. Pretty cool place. Up in life. It's unbelievable. Yeah. That inside is yeah. amazing. Tom? Yes? I told you I have privacy issues. <laughs> For heaven's sake, yeah. Check it out. Good morning, live from Lafayette. This is, of course, the barn house I've been showing you all morning long. You guys have to come out here for yourself. Uh, in here, this little sneak peek of the uh, five-story silo that's been converted with glass on every floor. You can see all the way up. Just a spectacular view here. Only one feature of many that makes this a truly strange structure. It is all part of Lionsgate Center, which is an event banquet wedding facility here in Lafayette. And this barn house is actually almost 100 years old. It worked uh, as a dairy farm for many years and then was converted. How many years did it take to convert this into a, into a beautiful home? Uh, about, two about two and a half years of hard work to make this now the gorgeous, gorgeous home with uh, all kinds of guest suites, office space on the fifth floor of the silo. We took some video early on. Let's show that video real quick. It is absolutely, to, uh, to say what the kids say these days, off the hook, off the hook. By the way, if you're interested in, in renting these facilities or if you happen to be uh, unlike me, about to get married, you can go on to lionsgatecenter.com. That's lionsgatecenter.com. Uh, and they got everything you need there. Reservations, more information, directions, et cetera, et cetera. So check it out for yourself. In the meantime, we're going to give you more of a look uh, throughout the morning here of this uh, dairy farm converted into an amazing, amazing, strange structure. And uh, I don't know, there are obviously, clearly, no wedding bells in my future, so I have no need for the facility, but... Uh, trying to think of any other single guy in the studio, any other single guy, if there are wedding bells are ringing. You know what? I've actually started to plan my next three weddings. Yeah. Oh, really? And, and while I don't have locales, I certainly have motifs for each of them, and uh, that would certainly fit for number two, I oh, believe, Tom. is the one where right. I think a barn motif would work. Sure, Tom, is, as long as they're not all at the same time. Well, I don't know these ladies either. Oh, I'm just I see. saying, I'm just planning my <laughs> next gonna pick, Are you going to pick the ladies based yeah. on where you'd have the wedding? We'll get to that stuff later. <laughs> I'm just taking what I know and going with it. Gotcha. Good morning, Colorado. I'm Chris Parente. Our strange structure week continues with a look at a silo like you've never seen. Good morning, Colorado. I'll bet Britney Spears could afford a cool crib like this one. Check out a truly strange structure. Where am I and what's the deal with the floor? The answer coming up. Well, our unusual week of strange structures continuing this morning. A barn with a twist. Yes, WB2 News reporter Chris Parente live to give us the tour. Hi, Chris. Oh, oh, I didn't see you there, Natalie. Pardon me. It's a good thing I take my showers fully clothed, isn't it? Very happy about that. Check this out. We are here uh, at Lions Gate Center up in Lafayette. This is a silo, a five-story silo converted into uh, restrooms, a wine cellar, uh, offices on the fifth floor. This place is truly, folks, a strange structure. Take a look at some of the video we shot earlier. Used to be a working farm about 100 years ago. Uh, it was a dairy farm. Uh, about two and a half years ago, construction began to convert that old barn and silo into an amazing, strange structure. And I mean it is amazing now. Uh, no more cows, no more hay, but some amazing uh, architectural features here. And, uh, well, hello, Marie. How are you? Good. How are you? You are the proud creator and owner of this, right? Yes, sure am. There we are. <laughs> We're way up here on the fifth floor, Rick. My photog's way down there. So, Marie, tell us what inspired uh, this design on the silo, because I've never seen anything like this. 
Well, it was actually uh, basically an idea from one of my employees. She had been to New York and there was a building that had a very tall and it had a piece of glass on the floor that you could see all the way down to the street level. And uh, she mentioned that to me and I, five minutes later, called Tom and said, I've got an idea for the floor. And I called the architect and said, figure out how to make it work. <laughs> make it so. It's amazing because you can walk right onto it. No problem. You're not going to fall through, are you? Oh, heavens oh, no. no. Oh, no. And the top floor here, <laughs> Beautiful 360 view. This is the office up here, right? Yep, this is the office. And then way down at the bottom is the wine cellar. Yep, and then two bathrooms in the middle. And this is, of course, attached to the, to the barn, which was at one time a working barn. You kept a lot of the original features as well, right? Yes, definitely wanted to keep a lot of original pieces, for sure. Talk a little bit about a Lionsgate Center, because this is part of a facility that does a lot of banquet, wedding, reception work, right? Yes, we sure do. We do about 400 a year. Uh, a lot of weddings, business conferences, all kinds of events. We've been doing it for 15 years. I've got to know, because as, as the world knows now, I'm a shy guy, just <laughs> type I am. How do you take your showers and use the restroom when somebody on the fifth floor might be looking down at you on the third? Well, there's just two of us, and we're married. <laughs> <laughs> That's always a good start, yeah? Yeah, well, if there, if there's tricks. When we have parties, we have guests over, there's a trick. We can, we can cover some stuff up for those people who aren't as voyeuristic. <laughs> yeah, put the, maybe put a towel down on the floor if you need to. Yep, sure can. <laughs> All right, it's excellent. Well, I've had a great time this morning. Thank you so Thanks. much. that was fun. If folks want to come out here and maybe reserve, I know you've got like a little bed and breakfast thing going on. You've mm -hmm. got the uh, event center. What's the best way to hook up with you? Um, they can just look up our website at www.lionsgatecenter.com. Excellent. There's virtual tours and pictures and all kinds of information. All right. Thank you much, Marie. Thank Appreciate you. it. I've burned a lot of calories this morning walking <laughs> down the spiral staircase. I'll tell you that for sure. So if you uh, don't have any issues with people seeing you from fifth floor to the first, this is your place, a truly strange structure. Now, Tom, if you'll please pardon me, I've got to finish getting ready. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm going to lay down the, the floor mat there yeah. to get that done. See ya. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Wow. That was cool. Isn't that amazing? I've never seen so that place. place. I've never really heard anything about yeah. it. It looks fabulous. Thanks to Chris. We all know about it. 400 weddings a year. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of weddings. Yeah. That's more Pretty than cool. one a day. Yeah. <laughs> yes. They're booked, man. Pick it up. I heard somebody Keep saying, oh, moving. that'd be a great place to have it. I'm like, yeah, if you can get in, better like book Plan ahead. Plan for a few years.